What's up guys, welcome, my name is Lukao and today as you can see by the title of this video we are going to be talking about Titanfall and uh, you know the recent news about it and this will be a short commentary because you know it's just mainly I'm just going to talk exactly about what happened and my opinions on it so I don't know how many months ago but uh, Titanfall was supposed to be you you know you paid 60 bucks for the game and that's it, you know, you have full access to the game, there's not gonna be, you know, microtransaction BS, there's not gonna be all that stuff, but of course, of course they already changed that, there's gonna be, uh, just like it is in Call of Duty, they're gonna make a season pass, which is 25 bucks and you'll get access to 3 uh, DLC maps that are coming in the future, I guess, or you can pay, you know, 10 bucks for each. Now, I know it's cheaper than, you know, the Call of Duty Season Pass. Myself, I didn't buy it this year because, you know, Call of Duty Ghosts is not the best game ever. But I find amazing that no one says anything against Titanfall. They said that they would not, you know, put microtransactions or anything like that, you know. Exactly as I said in the beginning of the video, you'd pay 60 bucks for the game and that was it. But now they changed their mind. And to be honest with you, I hate that this is becoming the standard, the standard of console games. And, you know, if this continues, I'm pretty sure the console will just die out and, you know, PC Master Race. Because the PC is already ahead of the consoles by miles. I don't care what you say or who you are, but the PC is indeed number one. The games are cheaper, you know, most of the big, big, big games are for free. And it's not pay to win. And I'm not saying that Titanfall will be pay to win. But it's definitely pay to get more stuff. Okay. And I know that's exactly the same as, you know, usually other games. For example, if you take League of Legends as an example. Uh, the game is completely free. And uh, you have no disadvantage whatsoever. If you don't put in, in money into it. And when they release new champions or new characters, whatever... It's free. You don't need to. You don't need to pay. You don't need to pay extra. Now, paying sixty bucks for a game that's already pretty expensive. Uh, you know, seeing that most games out there now on PC, you know, the games get that usually go viral and everyone plays it, go around twenty-five to thirty bucks. But no console games. Let's put it sixty. Let's put it sixty, because you know they're gonna pay for it, and you know. Myself, I don't think I'll... Uh, I actually don't know if I'll buy Titanfall or not. If I do, it's definitely going to be for the PC. And uh, yeah, that's that's just the video for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Macau, and I'll see you guys on the next video.